Hello, humans and pets. Salsa Verde, grilled chicken burrito from Taco Bell, and the electrifying blue raspberry strawberry slush, and the electrifying uh, wild cherry strawberry slush. Those are what we're eating today. They're both strawberry slushes? That's what you, that's uh, what you call them? Well, it's electrifying blank and strawberry. Okay. Um, the cashew is TikTok. There it if is. If you're wondering. Um, but it says, All right, what are we trying first? Taco Bell. Are we going to try the food first? Or the... We'll try the sloosh. Yeah, I told you to get a spoon here. Yeah, so I'm going to, need again, need a spoon. Now, they did melt in the car a little. Can you grab a spoon? Yeah, I'll grab a spoon. Because I can't stir it with this. So that is what happens when we drive home. This one, I might get enough out of this one. The spoon is really big. There you go. So, we're going to be trying it today. Is this my straw? Ooh, this is multicolored. Is your straw on? Yeah, so it, they both technically are, I guess. Electrifying. We'll, 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 be the, we'll be the reviewers of that. The judge of that? All right. Yeah. Let's see what we got. Ooh. I like it. Very Electrifying. cherry. It is like holy cherry. Wow. Very sour. Reminds me of a slush puppy because it got that little tingle, you know, like the icy. That, like, is, that is some big cherry going on right there. Definitely wild cherry. Yeah, I'm just going to. Because that cherry is wild. That's the blue. That rice. is like the most sour oh. cherry that I've had in a while. Stir it if you need to. It's like blue raspberry toothpaste. But like fluoride. I don't get fluoride. It definitely has a... Uh, I'm going to get ice head, though. Which one I like more? I'm going to say cherry on this one. I'm not a fan of this one. Blue raspberry is not it. Both of them are very sour. I think I like the blue raspberry better. To be honest with you. Cherry is better. Cherry is very pucka Very power. cherry. Very pucka power cherry. I think this is the best slush we've had. Talk about wise. But I would not want any more of it. Well, that, that that's... I mean, yeah. It's good. It's very like whoa. Yeah. Now with the new year, I want to do more get out and do thing reviews rather than just the lame reviews. Um, that we've been doing for the past little bit. Just call that reviews lame. No, she got a okay. lot of the hot sauce because he asked for the hot. I asked sauce. for the hot. Right. I, I couldn't remember the, the the name. Fire and Diablo. Yeah. So I just said some hot sauce, but. All right, you ready? Oh, I smelt it. I, he smelt it. You <laughs> want to know why? Because when he when she gave us the bag in the it car, it didn't smell like tuna fish. All I could smell was tuna fish, and I'm like, "What did you order?" I don't know where we got that. It, it's what I could smell. All right, and I think it's just the the when you fry like the mm. the bread. I only got bread. I almost got chicken. Was, you gotta take bigger bites. It was only bread. Oh. Well, what do you think? I like it. It has rice, has chicken, has a ton of cheese. You get that salsa verde flavor. Mm -hmm. You don't really see it though. But I'm not getting a ton of cheese. How much was this? The total came out to be eleven dollars. Right, but these were like three seventy each. Okay. I'll try it with a little hot sauce. It'll probably two bucks. I have the VC. I'll look. I, I don't hate them. It's it's good. Yeah. But now, is it? Beefy potato real good? No. They're two dollars each, exactly. I mean two dollars it's not bad, but no, I it's not. But uh, talk about I'm a big Chalupa fan. Big front trap guy. Right. 
Well, we we like most of the stuff that comes mm -hmm. out of Taco Bell, really. But I'm that's what I'm saying. If I'm going to compare this to the majority of stuff we've eaten from Taco Bell, mm -hmm. put it somewhere in the middle. This would be. It's not the worst, like the three layer bean burrito or whatever. Five, but I didn't it does like have, that one. But you know what? It is it just me or is it kind of bland? Like I wish the salsa had more something. It's not really spicy. It's just a flavor. I wish they added more. That's of that what I'm saying. Flavor. Like, like to me, it's almost like it needs a seasoning. Like it, it's, it's kind of like, I don't know. Like it just needs more sauce. Okay. If we were to get this at Moe's or somewhere else, we'd be like, the chicken is it has no flavor. The chicken has no flavor. It's Taco Bell. Okay. For Two dollars. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. I'm eating it, oh. and it's good. Mm -hmm. But it's not. It's not one of their best. No, it's not. It's not by, by far. Actually, like I don't know what it costs, but would I want that chicken chalupa that we had, or or anything else? Pretty much anything else, other than the Mexican pizza, or the the three layer layer bean. I didn't like that one. I actually liked it. It just I would never get it again. It was like a Walmart burrito. This one m might be that might be the only thing that we've had from Taco Bell that's below this. Is um, what I'm going to give this for a rating. Out of all the stuff we've had there, this I would never buy I'd give this it a again. Seven out of ten. It makes me happy. If somebody gave it to me, but I would take the classic taco over it. I don't know what's holding it back so much. I think it's just they need more of that sauce. It doesn't have a lot of it. Honestly, mine doesn't have a lot of anything. I mean, it wasn't overly. Right, I get it. Two bucks. Right. But. For one dollar, yeah. The beefy potato Rito. I don't know if they still have it. No, but that was way better. Like it had a nice flavor to it. It was seasoned up nice. Come on, you can come say hi. Um, you know that that's what I'm, I'm that's what I'm judging it off of. When, even the two dollar one, you know, you had the potato one. You had so many so many things we've had off of Taco Bell. Yeah, that were a lot decently more. priced. That would tastier than what we just did let's put mm. it that way so as was far it the as the worst thing no. no was it the best not even close but i i i wouldn't get it again somebody gave it to me i eat like 10 of them i I'd, I'd, I'd eat three more don't get me wrong but if you're gonna pick it apart as far as just better stuff in my opinion as much worth as a try though as much as i didn't like the chicken and a flatbread that they did that was better I like that one. I know you did. I, I did. Right I, it direction. felt like it was incomplete sandwich, but at least that had more to it. I agree with you. This needed. This might have been better too if there was just. It, I didn't mind the rice, but it definitely wasn't my favorite Taco Bell item for sure. Um, if you're next to a Taco Bell and you want to give it a shot, I wouldn't hold you back. I would I'd not recommend. I wouldn't I like say the rice, don't eat it. Right, the cheese, but, the chicken. I just wish it had more of that sauce. It definitely or a, another sauce. You know what I mean? Something else. Mm. I mean, it wasn't bad when I hit it with a little bit of hot sauce. Right, but it definitely. It, I pretty much would order almost everything else on the menu before I would get it again. Yeah, that's. I get that, but it wasn't bad. Right, you know, but I don't think I would order it. Again. So I'm, there you I'm go. I'm sticking to my 7 out of 10. Okay. 7 out of 10 is good. Everything at Taco Bell is like 10 or 9 out of 10. You know? For the most part. And then you have some that are like a 5, 4, 3. But I want to know what you think was good about that, though. It was okay. I just like the rice and the burrito. I, it, yeah, and but I, I think it needed way more salsa. It needed way more... The chicken needed... It, it, the chicken, there wasn't a lot of. The chicken, it, like, hey, there was only a little bit. Cheese, but so. the, yeah, see, mine had no cheese in it. Yeah. And it, and it had just a little bit of rice, a little bit of chicken. But my, my main complaint was, you know, we've had chicken at a lot of different places. And it was just no flavor. It was like boiled chicken. Yeah. You know what I mean? There was no flavor. And when we had that at Subway, we were like, yeah, it tastes like boiled but then chicken. But they fixed it. Well, then they, right. This so one, this needs to be. It needs a seasoning. Your, your chicken should have something. It's chicken. Okay, then then salt and pepper would have made it. Yeah. Yeah. Anything. 
That would be my complaint. So I would give it a five out of ten. Going back to edible. These slushes, the blue one is just not great. No, I don't mind a blue one. Well, I don't know. I just drank this one because this one was so sour to me. The blue but, one has like nothing going for it. These these are both like really like get pucka, the red one. Pucka power sour. So it's electrifying. I don't know what makes it electrifying, but it's it's probably isn't great for you. Yeah. So well, there you go. We'll keep it short and sweet. Uh, again, I'll go with your theory. Get it if you want. Yeah. Uh, um, I wouldn't get it again. Let's put it that way. It was okay. Would I get one of these again? I get the cherry one, the Baja Blast, and then that one. That one's just not good. It's not bad. It's just it. It almost it's almost blueberry now. Yeah. When you do the blue raspberry the and strawberry, the strawberry, it kind of turns into a blueberry. I think but. wild cherry and strawberry matches it better. Yeah. So, well, there you go. Keep the suggestions coming or make some suggestions. We greatly appreciate it. Any, yeah. any ideas, uh, you know, will help steer us in the right direction. Hit that like button. Hit the like button. Check you, out Less Cash, More Mash. Oh, it's not on my shirt. Not on his shirt, but he has fun over there. Yep. And uh, there you go. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Dong!